how to get a list of agents in your city for free using no code. Zillow's Agent Finder is a free tool that allows you to search for real estate agents. You can search for agents in your city and get information including agent name, number of reviews, phone number, and more. But what if you want to get this data into a list or Excel file? Well, in this video, I'm going to give you a step-by-step -step guide to get real estate agents and their contact information for any city. We will use web scraping with absolutely no code. My name is Ariel Herrera, your fellow data scientist with the Analytics Ariel channel. We bridge the gap between real estate and technology. I am passionate about providing data solutions. And if you are too, then follow my channel to get the latest content of real estate analytics. And stay tuned to the end where I show you how to automate your bot to get agent data for multiple cities. All right, let's get started. I am on Zillow's Agent Finder page. Here we can find agents local to a market. This can be used by first time home buyers as well as wholesalers that are looking to market their latest deal. On the Agent Finder page, we can search for agents in a location. This includes neighborhood, city, or zip code. Once we search a location, we receive all agents within the area. We receive information like agent name, reviews, agency, and phone number. We could copy down each row into a spreadsheet, but that would be tedious and open for so many errors. This is why we will use Browse AI to web scrape the data. Once we train our bot, we can use it for any city. What is Browse AI? Browse AI is a web automation software that learns to perform data extraction, monitoring, and automation tasks on the web simply by observing someone perform the actions just once. Browse AI records your actions as you move through a web page. It can scrape many sites, including social media, county information, real estate websites, and more. Browse AI has a free amount of credits per month. Use the link below to receive a 10% off if you later sign up for a plan. Here, I will click login since I already have an account. To create a new robot, I select Build New Robot. There are two options here. We will select Extract Structured Data since we want to get the data for an entire page. This allows us to download the data as a spreadsheet later on. Next, we start with our origin URL. This is our starting point for the website we want to scrape. Let's copy and paste Zillow's Agent Finder Tool website. Now, we can start recording our task. A new window is open. Browse AI is now recording our actions in the window. Select OK Understood to continue. Enter in the location. I will enter in my city, which is Tampa, Florida. Once the page is loaded, scroll down to the bottom. Here we see agent information in the area. There are additional pages of agents that we'd like to scrape too. Click on the bot on the right-hand side to open the recorder menu. Here we can select Capture List to get the list of all agents. By hovering over the agent profiles, we can capture the list. Click List. Next, select the text to capture. Here we'll select several data points to return to our spreadsheet. Once all data points are selected, click Enter to finish. Our next step is to enter in a name for each field. You can name these fields any name you'd like. I will use Camel Case to name each field. Once all fields are labeled, a pop-up box of our captured list will appear. Here, we can see each row represents a different agent with associated fields that we selected. There are 10 agents in total. However, we want to receive all agents that are on the page. Towards the bottom, select the pagination type to set how we will retrieve additional data. Select click on next to navigate to the next page. Select the next arrow button for Browse AI to log how to go to the next page. Once done, name the list. Set a limit for how many rows you want to retrieve. Here I am selecting 1,000. You can make this number smaller to return less rows as well. Click Capture List. Browse AI notifies us that we can select more data. Click OK Understood. We are done. Click Browse AI and select Finish Recording. Browse AI now uploads the recording. 
We can rename our robot to any name we'd like. Here, I will keep it as a default name. The next step is to review the bot's results. We can see a preview of the data retrieved. This matches the data in the first page of the Agent List Finder for Tampa, Florida. In total, 250 rows were retrieved. We can select all 250 items to view the full page. At the bottom, Browse AI provides us a final screenshot. It states on the right-hand side all the steps that it took. Once satisfied, click Yes, looks good. Our robot is set up. But what if we want to get data for multiple cities? Well, this is easy. All we have to do is change the location parameter to whichever neighborhood, city, or zip code we want to get agent information for. We can run tasks from within the page. We can also do bulk run to run the robot for multiple cities at once. There are several options including view history, monitor robot performance, and integration that includes the use of APIs as well. This can be useful if you want to auto-populate information that came from the bot to your CRM. If you haven't already, please subscribe to get the latest tips on real estate data analytics and check out my next video where I'll show you how to get agent data using Python with the Zillow.com API. Thanks so much for watching.